All right, reading through your problem says A is following B along a certain road. So if A is following B, B's up here, A's back here. And if he's following, they're going in this direction over here. All right? I'm going to say A's rate is X miles per hour, and B's rate is Y miles per hour. All right? So A is following B along a certain road. What happens is B turns around in the opposite direction. What it goes on to say, if, if A and B approach each other five times as fast as before. So what I want to do is talk about if they're going forward, the rate of approach would be, well, X minus Y. All right? X minus Y. So again, the rate of approach would be X minus Y. What are they telling you, though? If B turns around, what's the rate of approach? It will be X plus Y. All right? By the way, I don't know what the rates are, but assuming the rates are positive numbers, right? I just don't know which one's bigger or smaller. It doesn't much matter. But what they go on to say is that the rate now is five times as great as before, which means I have to move five times this guy over here, right? It's five times faster, right? So what I do over here is, you know, I, I got to simplify this. What do you get? You get 5x minus 5y. This is x plus y. I'm going to keep writing this down. And what would you get? You would get 4x equals 6y. And what they want to do is they want me to compare the rates. So they want a ratio. And I'm going to say they want the ratio x to y. All right? So let me just see if that's, if that's what they want. A is following B, B in opposite direction, if A push B. Compare their rates. So I'm really comparing the rates with um, A and B. All right? So what do you get over here? It would be x is to y as 6 is to 4. You should reduce that. What's that going to be? 3 halves. So x's rate to y's rate is in the ratio 3 to 2. Whoops, not 3 to 3, 3 to 2. We're done. Thank you.